Oh, you guys ready? The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, representing Brizongo from Boston, Massachusetts. Weighing in at 244 pounds, Fandango! You realize just because you wear a badge doesn't make you a cop, right? He's no a... more than putting chicken feathers in your ear makes you a chicken, Byron. Or Byron, just you sitting here at the announce desk doesn't make you an announcer. You know what? You guys aren't going to cram my style. I'm fond dangling like it's 1999. You can't cramp something that doesn't exist. Huh? 1999? Well, it's a play on words. No matter how you feel about the personality of Fandango, he is one of the most talented superstars inside the ring. And he's got great style, too. Uh, here comes the powerhouse known as Fabian Eichner. And his opponent, representing Imperium from South Tyrol, Italy, weighing in at 220 pounds, one half of the NXT Tag Team Champions. The man who made his WWE debut in the Cruiserweight Classic, but in the years since, has added over 20 pounds of pure muscle since joining NXT and amazingly lost practically no speed. Indeed, an intense grappler who lives by the creed, the mat is sacred. And he appears he's ready to impose Imperium's will here tonight. You know, I read on social media that Eichner's the second Italian-born WWE superstar since Bruno Sammartino. Don't go righty Fandango off in this matchup. He's always been much more than just a pretty face. That's right, Fandango is an impressive athlete and hard worker. He's also been around the block here in WWE and still looks just as good now as he did when he debuted. Yeah, Fandango is a resilient superstar who is determined to never go out of style. And across the ring, there's Fabian Eichner, always a menacing presence inside the ring. While Eichner's physique is impressive, it's his athletic ability that proves to be alarming for opponents. But Fabian's X-Factor, and he'll be looking to put it to good use tonight. Ugh. Oh, backbreaker. And a Russian leg sweep. Finds a counter from Fontango. Back and forth from these competitors. And Eichner with the wherewithal to counter. Big forearm. And Fontango is facing. There aren't many dents in the armor of Fabian Eichner, but how can he prevent his opponent from exploiting any weaknesses, Corey? But if Eichner can keep up his intensity and keep pressing his opponent, it'll be an arduous task to find any holes. Not a very effective pin attempt. Hurled away. God. And that could end up putting Eichner on shaky legs a bit. Hard work paid off for Fondango on that attack.
drop kick. An arm wrench. DDT. He may be in a bad way here. Yeah, Cole, but at this point in the match, you still haven't lost the edge. Great height. Suplex. And Fabian can't stop any offense coming his way. Yeah, now Eichner's got to turn the momentum around. And Fandango didn't see... from Eichner. If this lands, it might be all over. Oh Is that what it takes to beat Fandango? Maybe Eichner gets the win. Ah, uh, look, it, I don't think they're done, Corey. I don't think they're done. No, they're absolutely oh, no, not, not with the chair. Come on, put that damn thing down. They're going to finish what they started. Oh, come on, get out! Somebody do something about this! This is not gonna end well. Oh, thank God! Thank God! Coming to the aid of his fallen friend. But I don't think this thing's over. Not by a long shot. <laughs> 